Today, we and our 18 NATO allies agreed to do what we said we would do, what we must do to restore the peace. We actually crossed the border into Kosovo June 12th, 1999, and it was surreal, absolute surreal. It doesn't matter what you are in, in the real world, in this world, you're a general on the battlefield. It's shaped who I've become and how my life has progressed. My name's um, Adam Copeman. I'm a music youth worker. So the tournament me and Adam are entering is the tabletop battle tournament in Norway, uh, Moss. The other really enormous phenomenon as it became from the 1970s is the emergence of Games Watch. Brian did ask me a few times, he said, come on, you take a job. And I said, well, I'll tell you what, I'll, jo I'll join, but can it be on the understanding that one day we will produce this game? When we first got the license for it, um, it, it was all quite uh, quite exciting, really, because we were taken out of the studio and locked away in, into a room with all the archives which they were sending through. It's very exciting because you've got loads of information coming in and uh, people turning up. It's bloody hard work. So much competition, so many fantastic things out there, and you've got to compete for your slice of the, of, of the pie. Money is so tight, the budget is so tight in this household, I have to think about my family, I have to think about what's best for us. That was far straw for me, I snapped and I was on guard duty one day and I, and I was sitting there and, and I just found myself with the barrel of me rifle in, in, in my mouth. Another great week. Well done. Well done. As long as you're happy, I'm happy. I was very pleased with what you did last week. Very, very happy. And I'd like more of that, please. We're in the same boat Heading for different shores Facing each other Grasping at different oars We're cornered in a stalemate But the sun is down, it's getting late I've either gotta turn around or learn how to swim 
to me. I love the way you are. What's this all about? You got something you want to tell me, Kyle? You just show up here, push me around, expect me to want to talk to you? What are you hiding from, Kyle? Do you even remember what happened that night? It was 2 a.m., you weren't home. You know, I could always tell when you're lying, get that stupid look on your face. So, I will ask you again, who the hell do you think you are? Why don't you ever answer your goddamn phone? You wanna know why? Speak, damn it! You're acting irrational. I don't care. Stop it. Get off! Or all we have. <laughs> 